Awesome. Yeah, so, Broski, to. talk to me, man. I'm all ears. I'm a little bit late, so I apologize. I owe you no 15 hard minutes. What's <laughs> up, bro? What do you all need? Good. Yeah, man. Well, we've got um, we've got 60, 65 properties right now, and slow season in Cleveland, where we are, Northeast Ohio, basically. So, you know, we've been thinking a lot about the midterm and and trying to get into it. And we have got some good midterm bookings, um, some insurance people and stuff. But nice. Um, you know, my my question, my first question for you is, what do I do with sixty five properties? Right, like, should I be uploading them manually onto ALE's database, or even hiring a VA to do that, or should I be like finding someone and send them a spreadsheet? Like, what's the yeah. best way to communicate this large inventory to these companies? Okay, so then who ha, you you have a contact at the so that's a great question by the way. So you have you currently have a contact at one of the those companies that you've worked with, right? Yeah, we have a couple of them. Yeah. Okay. Have you asked them? I have. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What they say? Yeah, they they said like send us a spreadsheet or whatever, and I'll I'll send it to the boss, and she'll send it to the team. So. Uh, I, I don't, I mean, I did, um, a while ago. I don't know what happened to it after that. I don't think we ever got a call from it after that, but did you uh, follow up. That's what I said. Not as much as we should. Yeah. yeah follow up because, uh, one of the things we've done, um, like communication is so important and they actually appreciate the frequency. So I think and you're in the position where you need to start sending email campaigns mm -hmm. to these companies, right? Okay. That's going to be your leverage point because, you're, you're you're like with 60 plus properties dude like you i would even ask about what does it look like to become a preferred vendor right <clears throat> like mm -hmm. hey we've worked with you before because that's how i opened up the conversation but like hey we worked with you before what what would it mean to be preferred vendor they're all in ohio right yeah mm -hmm. dude that to me is preferred vendor like 60 is solid okay that you you own the block you need to be <laughs> having the conversation and you know what don't take no for an answer. Cause when I asked one person, they were like, Oh, just enter in a database. I'm like, no, you don't know what I'm talking mm -hmm. about. Like we're, we're trying to run Atlanta here. This is not a <laughs> right. onesie twosie. Right. I was asked who is the right person that can, that I can be put in touch to explore this. I even had this conversation with CRS. They're like, we actually have a thing specific for like landlords. And this is actually, we actually have an open item. This reminds me actually, now that I think about it. Uh, we're, we haven't done it. <laughs> we are supposed <laughs> to do an upload, but a hundred percent, like, uh, same, you want to start having a conversation where like you're seen as a vendor, not as a one, one, like small, like you guys are big. Right. And so you okay. act like it, right. And be like, Hey, by the way, like we have so much inventory that it would take us too long to upload, uh, in your database. Who would I need to talk to? Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. Okay, cool. Cool. Sure. So and then you say email campaign, like, should I be blasting everyone I have an email address for? Like, I would, I like asking for permission. So even if I get one touch point, I'm like, Hey, by the way, like Dave, is it, is it cool? If I, if I periodically remind you of the inventory that I have, I've never gotten to know. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. They need it. So I, the only reason I like to ask for the permission is just so they like, let the record show that I ask and that you're cool with it and it's not going to go to spam, right? Because mm -hmm. my goal is to build quality over quantity. So sure. even if I have two or three advocates in the company, they're going to be sharing my properties anyway. You know what just happened? True story. Lady from THD, she's amazing. We've helped place many people. She calls me. She's like, Ruben, I need your help. I'm like, oh, come on, baby. You know, I got you. <laughs> what you need? And... She's like, hold on. There's a lady in my office who's looking for this place. She said a name. I'm like, I Power Spark. I'm like, Powder Springs, George. I, I get. Then we get on the call. Marietta. I'm like, dude, of course. I got a property. I got first of all, I got so many properties in that area, whether it's ones I manage or own, or slash my mastermind students or partners, right? So absolutely, the answer is always yes. Now, now we're on a three way call. And I'm like, Oh, Kimby, Kimby is like my number. I'll oh, stop it. Oh, Ruben, we're joking around. Like it's I'm so serious. You put me on a three way because we had the relationship. Mm -hmm. And then I made Amanda feel like a sweetheart. Right. And she was super gracious. Like, Oh, Ruben, we're so grateful for that dude. Those are the conversations I want. Forget the you can blast. But I don't exchange that conversation any day because now Amanda is mm -hmm. going to refer me to who? Maybe Steve. 
Now and now they all now now I can name drop. Hey, by the way, I was speaking with so and so. I was speaking with Amanda. I was speaking with John. I was speaking with that. Like, and I'm name dropping. That's what I want. And maybe I would be strategic. Like, I believe believe in quality, but I would do okay. You do that for one company. You have like a one or two go to people. They're advocates mm -hmm. for you. And then you have this other company. You have one or two. That's the email campaign I'd be sending out. Even if you had a dozen people, that matters more. That you're you're you have your advocates and what you call like super fans. That are also saying, hey, like they're in a coffee house, they're like in the coffee room, but like, have you, you need to talk to uh, Dave, Dave at host, those guys, Dave, Dave in Ohio, have you spoken with them? No, no, I don't mm -hmm. know Dave. Oh, you don't know Dave? Oh, no, you got to talk to Dave. They, they take good care of me. Oh, you know Dave too? I just work with them. Like that's, that is the ideal goal that I'm going for. I want them right. to speak like that about us in house. And you know what? These companies are small that like, it only takes one or two people to start raving about you and you're Gucci. Right. Cool. Dude, you have a lot of properties, Good man. Stuff. There's a, it's, 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 it's a no-brainer for you, man. You, I'm trying to be like you when I grow up. <laughs> yeah, well, we don't. I mean, you know, we don't own them all. We, you know, no, I know. Managed, but, no, it's, but, you yeah. control own nothing, control everything. You're in control. That's what I do too. Like right. you know, if you if I include the ones that are part of the network, you know, there's over 30 properties. But like that, by the way, don't do not even like be cute about that because I'm I'm not cute about it. I'm like, by the way, like. If I'm like, if I don't have anything for you, I'll find you something. Why? Because I'm a licensed realtor. I'm connected to homeowners, mm -hmm. landlords, et cetera. I'm, just let them know we, we run Ohio. Like right. they need to know that. I'm serious. I'm not even being like funny about it. Like they need to know that like, hey, by the way, like I'm your plug for this city because I will find a way for you. And that, that goes a long way when you're like, wow, this guy is very resourceful. Whether you own, control, manage, co-host, arbitrage. It doesn't matter. We're going through Dave every time. Right. Even right. Mark, if he ever shows his butt anywhere. Yo, what's up with Mark, man? <laughs> I'm not going to put him on blast. I mean, this you, you know I'm the face of the company. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to send this clip to him. We're going to send him a snippet. He does all the work. I, you know, I do all the FaceTime. So. And all the good looks. Yeah. Mark actually gets all the credit because all our properties are in his profile. So all our reviews say Mark was a great host. Mark this, oh. Mark that. So this is my my 15 minutes. I love it, man. You guys got a dream team, man. You guys going to be in Nashville? Yeah, absolutely. You, I can't wait. I might go a week early just to see all my peoples. Oh, yeah. We're going to, we're going Sunday. I think we'll be there Sunday. Okay. I mean, right. if you got stuff for us to do Saturday, I could probably talk Mark into coming Saturday. So, yeah, we'll do, we'll do. I'm going to start because I'm sneaking around. I was just talking with a showgirl about it. We're like a week away, which is wild. Yeah. Good stuff, nice. man. Dude, you're yeah. my hero. I love it. Nah. I love the lab coat, man. I, I Dude, was, was going to grab I'm my... I'm buttoning uh... it up now, too. Like, people are not ready for the button-up version. See, in 2023, I was leaving it open. Mm. This is... This is... All business. <laughs> thanks bro. yeah i i was gonna i was gonna dig my old chemistry goggles out of storage but uh i ran out of time so maybe next time <laughs> you're trolling now <laughs> <laughs> i won't steal your thing no no i like it i like it yeah get into the spirit um, of it That's yeah awesome. well you basically answered my second question which was um you know how how do you connect with these people without being obnoxious or annoying? And so I think yeah, you you ask them, and then when they give you that permission, mm -hmm. you know we actually had a fun campaign we just sent out in Christmas. We're like, our goal is not to annoy you, but it's to serve you. What's actually a good cadence that you'd like to hear from us? And then we had one for once a month, two for t twice a month, three for four, and then they just 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 reply the number, hmm. and we got nice. replies. It was pretty cute. Nice, I like that. Um, yeah, just I mean, look, we care, dude. Like, I don't want to annoy the person I'm trying to work with, but I want to be stay top of mind and know how marketing works. So, how do we find a, a good common ground? Right, right. Yeah, nice, man. I dig it. My cool. man. Well, listen, you and I need to catch up with Mark too. So, but I think we'll see each other in about a month. So, yeah, we'll be looking there. Looking forward to it. Yeah. And uh, yeah, thanks for tuning in, man. Always showing love. I appreciate that. Thanks for doing this. This is fun. I figured I had to get on here and grill you a little bit. So Yeah, come on, man. I'll <laughs> take a few punches or two. <laughs> awesome, broski. Awesome. Well, listen, I'll let you conquer the rest of your evening, brother. And send uh, uh, send the lady my love. And, you too. Um, and yeah, I'll see you guys super soon. All right. Thanks, Raven. Awesome. Take care, man. Take care, brother. Cheers. Cheers.